Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting going to episode 5 of the Many Sides of Voice Actor Radio. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1. Yes. You would still do it.
Oh, she's just so short. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Even though she's still upset, sure. I mean, I didn't think she had so much Jesus. What? <laughs> Cause she's a bitch.
Damn. Of course. Damn. Yes. <laughs> it's not what you think. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Girl, not now! And look at ya.
Okay. price that they have to do the price of entertainment mm. no but this is sweet i love the fact that also they got to switch personalities with like disguises and such as well that was really adorable because like seeing them portray just a different version of themselves was really sweet and adorable as hell oh my god but no oh my god okay no her um what's her face's manager the short-haired one with the glasses she's so freaking cute and the fact that her and the other manager are literally gonna go out on a date just go and have a drink and have fun girl 
the best day ever. Go out, go get drunk, but not too, too drunk. Know your limits. Know your limits, yes. Make sure you get home safely. Always use the buddy system. Mm -hmm. You have that one thing where it's like, okay. And I only say this to... Mm, you either do it with really close friends so that you've known at least for like five years plus. You know, the, um, like, you share your location with them so that, you know, they know when you get home. Even though, like, you can say, oh, I'll text you when, you, when I get home. But if you might never get home. That's the smart part. But her, I, I like her, but she is extremely bitchy. Did, did she have the right to come in and say that to her? Yes. Because, of course, she's like, oh, hey, you know, one, one girl's trash is another girl's success and, you know, treasure. And it's like that at the end of the day because it's like, okay, yes, you get the backlash of this. And then, but at the same time, everybody else in this certain company would also be affected by one person's actions and such. Um, and it kind of sucks. It also reminds me, oh, God, am I going to tell this story? Okay, fuck it. Okay, so a couple of years ago, this had to be, this was before, this was before the pandemic. So this had to be at least 20, 28, 2017, 20, nope, 2018, 2019, almost 2020. Um, so at that point with my first YouTube channel, I, first couple, probably even second, um, before the first, I think it was like after the first YouTube channel got deleted and I had to move everything to my second. Um, I was streaming a lot on here and yeah, on here. And then I did like one little measly stream on Twitch, but then I like consistently went on to YouTube and just like that. Well, a situation happened on Twitch that kind of continued on into YouTube. Um, with one of my subs and such. And so it got really really bad to the point that I I was being nice and I confronted her about it I was like look I need to see both sides of the story and such because I'm getting everybody's story from the chat and then I'm get I have to have your story so that I can see like okay how you were in the wrong and such and I think um I think because of the fact is she's like a little bit younger than at the time she was younger than me. She didn't like the fact that I was coming, you know, like hard on her and such. And I had to make sure because I was like, okay, I can't come too hard and aggressive on her. But it's like at the same time, you know what you did was wrong by saying certain things to someone who has never seen me before, never seen me do anything on Twitch and stuff from coming from YouTube, X, Y, and Z. So... Because of this situation, I literally took off all of my mods um, on my YouTube channel. And I was like, I literally can't trust almost like certain amount of people because X, Y, and Z. So I had to have people like gain, I had to have people gain my trust again for them to be mods again. And so a lot of people were hugely upset with this girl um, over it. We, we were able to get the situation like cleared and everything and it's like that and such. But even now, like, I haven't streamed in, like, a hot-ass minute. Maybe one day uh, I will probably stream again because I really did enjoy streaming and talking with you guys, like, live at the moment, whether it's me playing a game or just me just, like, having a little talk and be like, hi, how you doing? da 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 <laughs> And such. But um, I would have to be, like, just really mindful of certain people and things that people will say because one minute it can be positive and then we can be very very negative and I don't like negative I like positive I'm just saying I mean because like I don't need somebody to make me cry on stream we've had that happen before <laughs> a lot of shit has happened to my stream more more good things than bad thank god but like only a couple of bad things but still that's all other than that, guys, that is my action view towards episode, let me make sure, five of the many sides of voice actor radio. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next <clears throat> on Wednesday for episode six. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.